The Shrine of St. Gabriele della Dolorata is one of the most venerated sanctuaries in the world. The shrine, located in Italy's eastern province of Teramo, attracts over two million pilgrims every year. Dedicated to the young passionist student who is known as the Smiling Saint, the shrine is preparing for the consecration of a new sanctuary on September 21st. Cardinal Ennio Antonelli will be at the event as Pope Francis's personal representative. Construction of the new shrine began in 1970 under the guidance of architect Eugenio Abruzzini. The architect stressed how the design of the new shrine to St. Gabriele highlights it as a place of penance and prayer. The place where the saint is present is a place of meditation and prayer, not a place of celebration. The other important operation for the shrine is that it is a place of pilgrimage. You go to ask forgiveness. So the area of reconciliation is a very important place. Father Natale Panetta, the rector of the shrine, also emphasized that pilgrims from all over the world travel there not only to pray before St. Gabriele's tomb, but to participate in the sacrament of confession. This shrine is one of the most visited in the world, especially in Europe. We have roughly 40 confessionals, and every Sunday there are from 20 to 25 confessors available for confession. So it is one of the most visited shrines for confession. The rector of the shrine expresses joy at the Finnish sanctuary and the positive reaction from visitors and pilgrims. When I see people entering the new basilica, their jaws drop, because while it is modern, it is also very welcoming. The sanctuary is located near another shrine dedicated to St. John Paul II, who inaugurated the crypt of St. Gabriele in 1985.